Amari Cooper, the guy the Browns went out and acquired to be the number one wide receiver, um, out at uh, Browns training camp today, uh, talking about Deshaun Watson and his skill set. Remember, uh, Cooper has caught passes from Derek Carr, Dak Prescott, and now um, will do so from Deshaun Watson. Every every um, quarterback has their you know nuance. Um, you know, some throw harder than harder than others um, some uh, have a faster release you know different small things like that but I mean you know over the course of your career or, or my career um, you know like I said this is in my my first year in the league or my first year playing football I've had, I've had the opportunity to play with a lot of different quarterbacks so I think I've played with you know most types you know what I mean I played with guys who release the ball fast play with guys who throw throw hard you know what I mean so um so yeah, it'll be just adjusting to who's back there. Where's Watson rank among those quarterbacks? And what you've been able to tell? What you what you mean rank in what category? I guess skill set. Yeah, I mean he's right there at the top. I mean uh, he could do everything. Like I, I I call him the magician. He uh, he just makes plays out there. Um, he's he he's incredible. You know some of the stuff that I've seen on film with shoot going back to him at Clemson. Um, he he just makes it happen. So uh, he's definitely up there at the top. And Quincy, um, that's kind of what you would expect uh, your wide receiver to say, but you can tell by the way it was framed by Amari Cooper, he believes it. Yeah, yeah. By the way, Amari Cooper, future NFL head coach, he <laughs> answered and not answered. Zach still been at that point, right? Like, rank all the quarterbacks. <laughs> what a question to be asked, right? In your first week of training camp with a new quarterback. And he was like, he's up there. And just moved on. <laughs> did, it, did it elaborate or nothing? And, you know, Amari Cooper has a future in, in, in head coaching as far as press conference ability goes. Um, but, yeah, it, it's going to be interesting to see how Amari Cooper fits with the Deshaun Watson. I think he actually fits really well. You look at what Watson does well, right? Watson does timing routes well. He's really accurate with the football. He anticipates very well, right? What does Amari Cooper do really well? Anticipation routes, right? Um, he's especially good at outs and, and, and working outs in the end zone. I mean, the famous Deshaun Watson play back in Clemson is him going to Hunter Renfro to win the national championship. That is a route that 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 Amari Cooper has not just mastered, has invented new ways to run um, since he's been in the NFL. So those two being that good at those type of things, um, the anticipation stuff, the going over the middle, stuff like that, I think they're going to be a really, really good fit together. I think that chemistry is going to be pretty easy for those two guys to get because they, they're, again, they're both good at the same thing. Now, that's not a guarantee. Obviously, we've been through <laughs> the whole quarterback wide receiver chemistry thing enough here in Cleveland, right? Like, we don't need to rehash any of this old stuff. But it, it's not a guarantee, but it is a good uh, look there. And, you know, it, people around the league respect what Watson can do. I mean, they all, you ask anybody around the league, they they still feel like he's one of the best out there. Um, and there's a reason why people perked up when the Browns traded for uh, Deshaun Watson versus, you know, when they knew they had to prepare for somebody else at quarterback. Yeah, the, the other thing that, you know, Cooper being a precise route runner kind of fits in with the whole timing and anticipation because if if you run the route, Deshaun Watson, if, if he knows where, he's, where you're going to be, he'll get you the ball. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's the thing, right? Deshaun Watson, he's going to get you the ball in the right spot. Um, you just got to be there. Or the one thing that he did that other quarterbacks who have been here in the past have not done is 50-50 balls, right? Like when he would give a guy a chance to to make a play on it, that was one of the frustrations about one of the quarterbacks that was here last year that took most of the snaps. Um, and, you know, that might not be a frustration this year where, you know, hey, if, if Donovan Peoples-Jones feels like he needs more 50-50 balls and you feel like you can give him a chance and he's going to come down with it, you have those opportunities because, again, Deshaun's really good at that. Other quarterbacks that have played here in the past have not necessarily been great at that, which has led to some friction, right, between that room and that position.